Hey, this is Fano Rina and we want to demonstrate Android 3.0 Honeycomb and uh, this is the Motorola Zoom which we will use uh, just for this example. Um, here is the home screen. Uh, this uh, version of uh, Android is optimized for tablets, for the bigger screens uh, and uh, similar to the iPad uh, it uh, uh, changes the interface so it's uh, very usable on these big screens. Uh, this one is uh, 10 inch. Uh, here we don't have uh, physical buttons anywhere on the front. They are always in the uh, bottom left corner. Uh, here we have a back menu and uh, sorry this is home and uh, multitasking menu button which will change the, the task. Here we have them as thumbnails. You can choose here you have email, uh, walk, contacts, calendar, they're, they're named on the left. So you can choose whatever uh, you have opened. The home screens of course multiple pages. You can personalize them with different widgets. Here we have YouTube, walk, whatever. Just uh, and here we have the options to personalize. You can add shortcuts, widgets, and many more. You can change the wallpaper. For example, let's get a, a shortcut. You get one and drop it in which page you want it. You drop more, even more. And then when you click the page, you have these shortcuts here. You can grab them and position them wherever you want. Let's check out the, the apps menu. Here is the menu where all applications are. There are uh, just a grid of icons. You can choose whatever you want. Um, let's uh, check out each uh, feature. Uh, let's start with the contacts. So contacts, uh, here we have uh, our left column with the contacts. You can see them listed by their first letter with uh, a small picture in their name. And on the right are their details with uh, phone numbers, emails, etc. addresses. So now this uses the call screen state and puts uh, part on the left and parts on the right uh, while on the phone you have to click and uh, change the page whatever. Let's go back to other apps. Menu, apps. Um, here we have the browser. Phone arena is already loaded. It's uh, very similar to any other browser, similar to Chrome on the desktop PCs. Scrolling is uh, S on the phones. You can uh, zoom with uh, gestures or you can double tap. The experience is very great on the big screen. It has a nice resolution. Uh, more apps. Uh, this one is a little wacky, but this is a prototype. Let's check out the music player. Here we have different songs. One with uh, album artist. Again, the left column has some basic information, the right has another info. Played, everything is again. Left, song info, uh, big cover in the center and big buttons, which you can tap easily. Let's go back to the home screen. In the bottom right corner, you have the clock and some uh, other useful uh, icons with shortcuts. Here we have the latest uh, calendar appointments, if you click them. We can see them all and uh, here we are in the calendar which is uh, reminding of uh, Google Calendar on a computer. We can see it by day, week, month, go to today. Uh, let's add a, an appointment. Here is a new appointment. Again very similar uh, Google experience. Let's go back to the menu. Home, apps, uh, for example Gmail. On the left we have uh, different folders, inbox, uh, send, outbox, and on the right are the emails. You, uh, you see them here with uh, a, a big uh, size so you can see uh, the whole, you can see the whole subject of the email. Click it and then uh, the emails uh, remain at, at the left and on the right you have uh, the email that, uh, that you've chosen to see. Uh, Similar experiences with the other apps, so we won't uh, show everything, uh, but uh, want to, uh, to get back to the idea. Uh, Honeycomb is uh, optimized for Android, uh, it's optimized for tablets, and uh, it is designed for, for tablets, not for phones. So uh, everything, is, uh, uh, everything is big, easy to use on this uh, watch space, and uh, you get uh, lots of information in uh, separate columns. And uh, 
the, probably the most important thing about uh, this uh, version is that it can be personalized by the manufacturers. So what you see here is the Honeycomb interface, uh, Android 3.0, and it will be the same here on the Motorola or in other tablets like uh, the Samsung Galaxy Tab 10.1 uh, and uh, the LG Optimus Pad. They all have uh, this operating system and, and it is exactly the same on the three phones. The only difference is their screen size, their resolution and uh, other uh, hardware features, but the software is always the same. So we think this is all about the, uh, the Honeycomb. If you want to learn more about it or uh, the latest uh, phone news, check out phonearena.com.